I'm Jody Miller. Let's get started. Last week, the nation's attention was focused on a runaway weather balloon thought to be carrying a six-year-old boy. It was kind of like Obama's campaign promises. You know, lofty and shiny at first, but found to be full of hot air and empty after crashing to the ground. <laughs> The GOP has introduced its redesigned webpage with several new features. For instance, when you click the link to donate to Senator Olympia Snow, it sends your check straight to the Democratic Party. <laughs> During a visit to New Orleans, a young boy asked President Obama, quote, why do people hate you so much? Hey kid, when you pay taxes in 15 years and you're still paying for all of his spending, you'll understand. <laughs> A new poll shows that Hillary Clinton is more popular than President Obama. So it looks like general corruption is now more popular than huge deficit spending. <laughs> Following Wolf Blitzer's disastrous performance, CNN's Soledad O'Brien became the second CNN anchor to perform poorly on Celebrity Jeopardy. And she did really bad in the category entitled Real Rush Limbaugh Quotes. <laughs> Speaking of Rush Limbaugh, he's been dropped from the bid to own the St. Louis Rams football team for being a, quote, divisive figure. So tune in and hear all about it on Sunday Night Football with Keith Olbermann. <laughs> the Obama administration is planning on giving checks in the amount of $250 to America's senior citizens. Yeah, it's so they can get a really nice final meal before Obamacare passes. <laughs> And finally, according to a new poll, Mike Huckabee leads the field of Republican presidential hopefuls in 2012. So let us here at Newsbuster be the first to say, congratulations on your second term, President Obama. <laughs> Thanks for watching Newsbuster, everybody. I'm Jody Miller. Make sure to tell your friends about us. We'll catch you next time.